Uh, my name's uh, Stephen Crosby, and uh, what I would like to do is uh, let you know the sort of things that we are doing uh, within the, the Nottinghamshire uh, area, and uh, specifically uh, the good relationship that we are having with uh, the Mansfield and the Ashfield and Sherwood branches. Um, we have recently had a very successful garden party, uh, initially starting out uh, really just to improve the relationship and get to know each other much better. Uh, we have been working uh, independently, um, obviously on local by-elections, but we work together uh, with the EU referendum. But as the party is moving forward, really this is a UKIP uh, Mark II, um, and uh, we now need to convince the electorate that we are uh, worthy of a vote. Uh, we need to uh, convince them that we are sincere, that our policies are uh, to the betterment of our local economy, uh, our local communities, and we also need to have people who get to know us uh, individually. So, uh, the sort of things that we were doing at the garden party, initially it was a get to know each other, then we uh, then opened that up to uh, inviting uh, neighbouring branches, a lot of uh, chairmen, chairwomen uh, uh, joined us, uh, we invited our local MEPs. Uh, then we also uh, uh, took the opportunity of inviting the, the leadership uh, contenders, five of them, uh, travelled, some from Bristol, uh, from London, uh, quite a distance uh, to join us and we very much appreciated their, their, uh, their, their, their presence and uh, we had a very informal uh, chat with them uh, and I, I do know that it certainly has helped uh, those who have attended uh, to make uh, a decision um, in, in this leadership uh, contest. So the sort of things that we are doing uh, within our own branches is um, uh, we're having a training session uh, coming uh, very soon and uh, that's an opportunity for not only for uh, those who are hoping to be candidates uh, in future uh, elections and by-elections but also those who you would regard as the foot soldiers for the election agents and for those maybe who have never stood in an election before. So uh, we're, we'll, we will be looking at all aspects of campaigning. Uh, we want to supplement uh, just uh, more than uh, dropping flowers through letter boxes. We need uh, folk who can knock on doors, engage with the public and uh, also then we'll be doing the digital uh, campaigning too. Uh, be that Facebook ads, um, and uh, we, we are hoping to have a, a website uh, created as well. So uh, it's very much complementary uh, to, to the traditional type of canvassing. Um, so that's the sort of things that we, we're, we're planning to do. We will continue to do street stalls. Uh, there's absolutely no way that we are ever going to win any election at all if we wait until just a few days or a few weeks uh, before an election and expect people just to vote for us because of an ideology. They've got to know us individually. Uh, they've got to know our message. Uh, and you know we have to, to work, we have to earn those, uh, those votes. So that is the sort of thing that we're going to be uh, doing. Uh, we also are going to be putting in place as soon as possible, we will have our candidates selected. They will know the wards that they are going to be working in and they will have the confidence. Now, we may call that shadow, uh, shadow councillors or UKIP uh, representatives for, for wards. They will know that they will be the candidate and uh, having that assurance, they can put their foundation into that local area, get to know the local issues. And by doing that, we can offer an alternative to the establishment, to the self-serving uh, politicians, career politicians that we've all met. Uh, we have a, a fantastic message. We need to just get that message out. 
thank you very much for your time and hopefully this video has been beneficial we will be updating uh, uh, as we have the training sessions and as by elections come up and uh, th th this will be the, the, the first of, of many videos thank you very much indeed